basically I'm here to welcome you to Training Room to You, which is an exclusive program that was put together by uh, Uncle Mike, the milkman, and myself uh, to basically bring the training room to you in the privacy of your own home. Uh, you don't have to worry about getting to the gym or getting here. Uh, you can do literally thousands of workouts with this uh, specially designed kit that we've put together here to bring the training room to you. So basically, let's have a look at the kit. These are called our Arsenal kits, by the way. So don't, don't mind the accent. You uh, don't have to adjust the sound things like in Australia. I've been uh, training with Mike and uh, Jim for uh, about two or a year and a half now. So uh, it, it's wonderful this setup that they've got going here. This is called your Arsenal kit, so you already uh, would have purchased this. So let's go through it. We've got our mat to lay on to do uh, sales, whatnot, but we'll go through each workout. There'll be a workout video posted daily, so this is just to show you through the equipment. This is called the USA. <coughs> this is a brilliant piece of equipment. So versatile. We'll uh, show you how to set up for your workout uh, with each workout video, but this is basically, yeah, it looks like a jungle mess, but it's basically uh, two handles. You've got spare handles here, and it's basically used for rowing. Um, and you can also do other types of suspension training with this. Really good piece of equipment. So we've got the USA there. We've got our TNT band. This comes with three bands. <coughs> three bands. But beginners should only use one band because the, the resistance with three bands on, uh, with two feet in, is about 300 pounds. So. Uh, from the beginner to pro, you uh, just put the one band through by stretching the band and just putting it in the handle, like so. Very easy to use, but as I said, I'll show you how to set up if we need to use them during our workouts. And it also comes with this uh, black stopper that goes in door jams. So this can either be used for your uh, USA suspension if you're going to put it in a door jam, or you can use this by just simply slipping it on. Uh, your TNT here. It's mainly used for rowing, um, pressing. It's all resistance training, which is a brilliant piece of equipment. So, we've got our trusty medicine ball. Plenty of stuff to do with this little puppy. We can slam ball. We can uh, use it for ab work. Brilliant piece of equipment as well. And second last, we've got our trusty kettlebell. You can see how to do all the kettlebell uh, movements properly by uh, looking through the host of videos that Mike has posted on uh, proper technique with the kettlebell. I'll be going over it uh, really quickly at the start of each workout. So our trusty kettlebell, use it, very versatile piece of uh, weight training equipment there. And we've got our trusty uh, irrigation box here, but what this is used is for storage, or you can use it as a step up box. This is anything sturdy enough for stepping up, uh, we can use it for um, you know, jumping, uh, we can use it for uh, incline, decline, push-ups, very versatile too, plus it's also your storage for your arsenal kit. So all that put together, levels one, two, three, um, <coughs> you would have already purchased your equipment, you can get it through the site, but uh, if you need to add to it or uh, go up in weight, you can order that through the site as well. Um, so just email us and uh, we'll uh, get you going there. So that uh, five pieces of gym equipment is all you're going to need for, uh, for all these workouts. Alright, <coughs> the only other thing that you will need is some sort of time keeping device. So, uh, the gym box here can be ordered through the site, it's really cool as well. Um, or you can simply uh, look at a clock on the wall, which is a little bit harder to keep looking over, but it'll, it'll do. Um, but most people have stopwatches on their phones or um, on their watches. So, uh, yeah, so make sure that you've got some sort of timekeeping function. It's not necessary for all the workouts, but uh, when, when we're doing time intervals, it is necessary. Um, <coughs> so, yeah, welcome to the training room to you. Um, just a note, with each of these workouts, you must do an adequate warm-up, so stretching joint mobility. You must do uh, warm-up movements and you must do an adequate stretch down. That's, uh, that's to maximize on uh, 
you're getting through the workout fine with no injuries. Um, what else do I need to say? That's pretty much it. Welcome to the training room to you. Oh yeah, the, the warm up is a video that you can search um, in the video library and it's just called Joint Mobility and Warm Up, I think. So um, Uncle Mike will take you through the proper uh, warm up stretching. He'll also take you through the um, uh, kettlebell warm up, which is brilliant, which you pretty well should do at home before any of these uh, workouts. And also the stretch down, which is just think top down, you know? Nice stretchy, you've got your forearm stretches because we're using kettlebells. Uh, we've also got hamstring stretches, glute stretches, calf stretches, which is really important. So, without further ado, let's get into some workouts.